Now, first of all, I'm trying to figure out why the fuck y'all ain't been on this podcast. Y'all want to be on everybody else's podcast. Why y'all ain't been on this podcast? Y'all crazy, like for real. I tell them like, sir, bitch, shut up and hustle. Shut up and hustle. Shut up and hustle. Shut up and hustle. I tell them like, sir, bitch, shut up and hustle. Shut up and hustle. Best of the best entertainment presets. Your feature presentation. What up, Milwaukee? Yo, what's going down, man? It's your boy, Sir Quinn, from Best of the Best Entertainment, where we keep our eyes and our ears open for local, global, up and coming and established artists. Today, we rocking out with the Lash Tech, Bar Spit, Multitaster, Boss Set, all the above. We rocking out with Introduce Yourself. You already know it's your girl, DJ, aka Diamond D. Follow me on all social media platforms, period. Yeah, thanks, man. We see you out here getting money, getting to <laughs> you the so, uh, so, what's going on? What you got going on? Man, well, I got a project dropping soon. I ain't got no date on it or nothing because, you know, you can't rush greatness. But uh, see the album cover. Yeah, you know, I got something in the works. So stay tuned for that. I hope y'all like it because right. I put a lot into this shit. Like, right. you don't even know. Facts, facts. But too much into this you. shit. I've been seeing you working, man. It's like people who don't know, man, like. We go way back like first class. <laughs> I was trying to tell you, listen. Like, hold on, I man. lived in the honeys my whole life. I ain't going to lie. We'll, we'll, we'll have for my whole life. And. This nigga been here since I was little as bitch, like no bullshit. <laughs> you can't drop some projects with the kid, man. Before uh, I was doing, like really taking music serious, like I recorded my first song here, like no man. bullshit. And went crazy, like <laughs> how your first song go crazy like that, like for real. So like, this crazy, cause like, all right, I got to jump into it. So like, how long have you been doing music? Cause like, uh, well, I'm gonna say I officially started writing music when I was like 12. Now, I never, I ain't rap it or like I wasn't recording or nothing until I turned probably like 17 or 18. Me and my sister Omni, we used to always come to the studio and just like play around and shit. But I ain't really start officially doing it till I was like 12. Cause I never thought I was good at it. Like I would always think like people would look at me like, you a rapper? Like, what? So, so I never like really did it until one day, me and one of my um, old friends, we was just like, on some bullshit like bro we need to make a song like we need to get we need to make a song so one day we just really did it and it was like it was lit everybody fucked with that shit so i'm like shit i really got that shit i need nah, to you a big shit talker like for real like that's that's what i call like big shit talker so <laughs> like like i i consider you way different than like female artists man like, i'm crazy. so happy you said that because <laughs> it's like man i'm i'm, I'm so i'm man, be so tired of hearing the like Mm, I ain't even finna go there because I'm moving. No, I'll, we gonna go there because <laughs> listen, I be so tired of hearing. Listen, I be saying that all the time. Like I'm not your average female rapper. Like, right. and I love that about myself, but then I hate it at the same time because it's like that shit that them bitches be saying. That's the shit that people want to hear. They want to hear right. that shit. Right. Like right. they want to live that lifestyle and and hear that shit. But I be more on the tip of like. Tell a motherfucker about yourself. What you finna do today? How much money you like? You know what I'm saying? Like, what, what you See, got going on for Everybody can't like, relate, DJ. Everybody can't relate, though. I don't you know, know. Like, you just, you just that nigga, man. Just put it on your, <laughs> just put it on your back. And just, like, everybody can't relate, hey, man. Like, you know, I try to stay humble. I ain't, I ain't, I ain't knocking nobody because if nah, it work, it work. You them bars, though. You don't be humble when you wrap them bars. You a big shit talker. I kid you not. You a big shit talker. So, um, I cut you off and shit. That was all rude and shit. But wait, no, because <laughs> I was gonna shit, say, I was gonna say, like, um, I never been really good with conversation. Like, even like this type of shit scared me. I never been good with conversation, so I figured out like, rapping is a way to express myself. Like, I can Ooh. say more Ooh. when I rap. You know what I'm saying? Because it's hard for Check me to ex for real. Like, it'd be hard for me to express myself. So I'd be like, I could rap that shit though. Like. I don't yeah. give a fuck. We, we in this room. I could rap about this whole room right now and make it sound lit as a bitch. Like, Bad. no bullshit. So, I just take that or shit. Or trash as a bitch, too. Okay. <laughs> <laughs> that's a different conversation. You but, stupid. like, yeah, but that's crazy, though. Like, and that that's crazy because, like, everything ain't meant to be said, too, man. Like, you got to leave it up to the music, man. Like, and that's, like, what does music mean to you, though? shit everything really i'm gonna be honest like it, my whole background is music like my cousins they've been making music like my mama she loved music i grew up with music in the house like music is life like when i feel happy i listen to music when i'm sad i listen to music when i'm emotional i listen to music so it's like 
my life is just revolved around music so facts facts so we just seen that video you just dropped man y'all can see it's rotating in the background man so let's touch on that man so what is that song about like that <laughs> <laughs> that ain't a good question. <laughs> oh shit, that ain't a good question. Like, what is this? Uh, let's touch on these lyrics, man. Let's so, touch on them. Man, it's not even one subject that the song is about. It's about mm -hmm. many different things. Like, honestly, it's about a, a lot of different things. So, I mean, y'all hear the bars. Y'all, y'all hear what's she, going on. She's like, introduced the intro. Formally introduced the song, man. Tell them where to find it at and all that too. Um, this Tay B freestyle, you already know, shot by Rich Nerds. Y'all can uh, find it in the link in my bio, or y'all can um, find it on Rich Nerds page uh, in his link in his bio. Um, it's not on all platforms yet because it will be on an EP, and I don't want to drop it that way. So if y'all want to see it, y'all just go to YouTube and y'all can run and views it. Facts, facts. So who you working with? Like who you? I see you. I see you out here gritting and grinding. Rich nerds. That's a name drop. You shit. see you in the studio recording a video. Drop two nights. Oh uh, shit. I ain't really gonna too much speak on like my engineers and my producers because I ain't, I ain't gonna lie. I ain't trying to give up that type of information. But uh, <laughs> with my uh, <laughs> when my shit drop, I got you though. I got y'all. Whoever y'all want to know, my shit drop, I got y'all. But uh. Um, as far as like videographers and shit like that, y'all know I fuck with Ray. That's my nigga. Period. Like, right. I get famous. That nigga coming with me. I don't give fuck. Jeez. Like, um, I f I've been fucking with Rich Nerds too. I fuck with Rich Nerds. You know what I'm saying? Um, in the future, I probably want to get something done by uh this one man. His name Michael Coley. He not even from Milwaukee though. He from Madison. I want to fuck with him though. But that's really about it. That's all I can really say right now. I can't say too much because I can't give away all the gems, you know. Right, so I feel you. I gotta shake up on that. I can't give them no gems like that. Like that. But yeah. Uh, so, so how you feel about uh, how to, how you feel about the Milwaukee music scene? Don't say you're gonna put it in the track neither, nigga. Man, everybody got their own style and their own shit going on. I don't like nobody. What's for people is for people, but I just wish people would rap about different things in Milwaukee. Like it's different it's other things to rap about. Like I know this y'all lifestyle and this what y'all live and y'all really out here doing this and doing that, but it's like I want to hear like as if as far as the females like I want to hear something else about pussy like I don't want to hear nothing about pussy no more. I want to hear something else like I don't want to. That's not what rap is about. So what kind of what kind of artists you listen to? Like what kind of what kind of what's your genre? Like what, I listen to all type of artists. What, what's your favorite genre of music? Um, hip hop, rap, hip hop, yeah, R and B, um, R and B. Yeah, I like R and B. Who your R and B playlist? Aaliyah for show. Sure. No Aaliyah in my R and B <laughs> list. I'm playing with my girl. Period. Jeez. Aaliyah. Um, you got a whole soul, man. Definitely. See, you, definitely. You, you destined for longevity in this career. Definitely. For real. I love Aaliyah. Um, I like listening to a lot of. SZA you can hear too. when you when you listen to your music. You can hear like. What kind of artist you are you could hear like the old soul like i'm just giving you i swear to god and that is so true because i feel like i rap how they used to rap in the early 2000s like you remember how people used to rap then yeah, when facts. rap made sense yeah, and shit facts. like facts. my shit sound like facts. that and that's why i feel like i can't catch up with the wave because i'm stuck in the real rap era like or like the yeah. 2000 rap era right. like i'm not i don't know how to do like the melodies and like mumble rap and like yeah. Drill rapping, like I don't know how to do all that. No, you're not stuck. I don't know if that's the correct term to use, but I'm underrated because people be saying like you good, you good, but it don't show. Like I'll be feeling like it don't show like that. Like, but what hopefully... city are you in? We in, we in the we in we in four one four. Yeah. We in Milwaukee. You already so, know. I already uh, know how that go. So we see we see that you uh. We see that you taking a took a took another hiatus too, and we are gonna touch on that right after this break. Y'all stay tuned. Shut up, shut up, shut up and hustle. Shut I tell them my sir, bitch, shut up and hustle. Yeah, yeah. Shut up and hustle. Shut up, shut up, shut up and hustle. I tell them my sir, bitch, shut up and hustle. Yeah. Yo, man, what's going on? In case y'all just now tuning in, man, we rock with my girl DJ, man, the official, the entrepreneur, and so, all right, you just took this hiatus. And it's crazy. Like, you got the website. I, I ain't gonna introduce it, but like, I see it. 
and everybody see it. <laughs> and you, you, you sport, you rocking it yourself, by the way. But you took this hiatus and uh, official lashes by D website yeah. official. But like, I, man, like I man, put a lot into my business. I, Thank you for everybody who support me. Shit, man, boss. Shit, <laughs> hold on, man, boss. Shit, like that's crazy. So, um, like. Talk your business. Well, I'm a lash tag. I've been doing it for almost like two years now. And um, it's been going good. Like, I'm not going to... Entrepreneurship is not for everybody. Like, it's cool to work a job. Do not think that you have to be an entrepreneur. Because this shit is hard. It's days where I wake up. I don't have no appointments. It's days where I wake up. I got 10 appointments. So, this shit ain't what you think it is. Don't never let nobody try to tell you, like, or oh, you ain't nobody because you work the job. Because I worked the job for many years. And... It got me to where I'm at now, you know? So just stay down. That's what I did. Just stay down and just be humble and focus and, you know. So how's that, how's, how's that business treating you like? It's been good. It's yeah. been good. I've been, I've been at it almost two years. My anniversary finna come up in February. So we're gonna see what, what happened with that. I just moved into a new location. So we, we moving up, we doing different things, so. Yes, what? yes. Where to find you? How we how, how can we find that? Where like find what? Official, official lashes. Oh, uh, I'm on Facebook, Instagram, Twitter, all of that. Y'all can find me on all social media platforms. DJ official lashes. Yep, at official lashes by D. That's my name on Instagram, and then my um that's my business page, but my personal page is Diamond D under slash. I mean underscore D with two E's. All right, so. Man, we know we best of the best. Like, I don't try to peg myself on music, but like, that's what we specialize in. You see this fat ass music over my neck. So, like, what's next for the music? Like, what's what's going on with the music? Like, what what you got coming up next? Well, you know, I got this project dropping, but shit, pretty much like after I drop my project, I'm gonna try to not even try. I'm going to be getting out of Milwaukee. Like, I'm trying to travel to Atlanta, Houston. I'm trying to get my shit out to certain DJs. I'm trying to rec work with certain engineers. Like, like I said, I love my city, but I don't, I don't necessarily want Milwaukee sound. I want a different sound, like, right. and I don't think I can get it here. So I got to go elsewhere to try to get that shit. So, yeah, copy that. Copy so that. that's my next move, doing that. So who you see yourself working with? As far as like Milwaukee artists or what? Like, no, just in the music industry. Um, shit, I haven't thought that far ahead yet. Like, it's not, that's not even a thought in my mind. One name, nigga. One name. Shit. So, like, somebody that I looked up to or something, like, that I would want to work with like that. <sighs> shit. Um, I don't know. I like J. Cole a lot. So, that would be somebody I would be Ooh, like. We, I did not expect. That one. Yeah, I like J. Cole a lot. Like, J. Cole be speaking. Whoa. Facts. So, J. Cole on your playlist? Definitely. You already know. Cole Whoa. World. Cole World. You already know. Shout out to J. Cole. If I ever get famous, you're going to see this. I been fucked with you long time ago. Like, whoa. Cole World. Yes. Whoa. Facts. So, um, let me see how. Like, what do you get? out of like being an artist because i listen this is what i took out of this question because like i seen you you got the official lashes hoodie yo <laughs> like dog like dude got the official lashes hoodie yo in the middle of the rap bid like gotta represent hold the, brand. the fuck on you know you gotta represent the brand hold on man listen hold on <laughs> Y'all see that video, man? Shout out to Rich Nerds, like. Period. Shout like, out my so nigga Rich Nerds. I'm gonna let you Nerds. answer that because, like, I answered your question a little bit, man. But like, what do you get out of being an artist? Like, what do you get out of being a rap a rap artist? Like, you, I, of course, you talking your shit too, but like, I just overall get the chance to express myself. Like, I love that shit. Like, I love being able to express myself like wholeheartedly. Like, and I feel like I do that shit on the beat. Like. Any beat you give me, I'ma do that shit. So, and I like seeing people happy. Like, not even. <laughs> I just like seeing people happy. Like I said, you know, music make you happy. So I like seeing people enjoy that. Where it's being wrote by me, like. Mm -hmm. So, I like that a lot. But yeah, overall, I just like being able to express myself through the music. Like, cause I don't express myself a lot. If you know me, then you know, like. 
I sit back and observe a lot, but I don't really be having too much to say. Like, I be thinking a lot of shit in my head, but I don't be having too much to say. Like, so. I definitely got to get you some shut up and hustle shit because your hustle is crazy. You won't say, you don't say shit, but your hustle is crazy. You sitting here like, nigga, why is you asking me all these questions, nigga? Like the hustle shows for itself and it does. It definitely does. All right, so we finna, we got a new segment of the show and it's called Words. And you hate words, don't you? <laughs> oh, shit, what? So, this that black smoke, y'all. Y'all type in to that black smoke, man. It's uh, no, nicot no, no nicotine, no tobacco. It's crazy. Um, so, I give you a word and you tell me what you think about this word. I'm just, I'm just going to say a word. I'm, it's called words. So, I'm going to say one or two words. You tell me what you think about these words. Like, don't ask me a question or nothing like that. Just just right off the bat, tell me what you think about these words. Okay? Okay. okay. The first word is failure. Disappointment. And you mean... What you mean? But you mean by disappointment, like when you when I think of failure, I think of disappointment. Like I know what you mean, but you got to tell them what you mean. Like I don't disappointment, know. failure would be a disappointment. Yeah, to you. I mean, to, to anybody, I feel like to anybody, to everybody. Like I'm not failing. So if that's the question, like help, like no, like failure is not even a, a, a word to me. That ain't the word. You will be disappointed with failure. Yes. Jeez. Okay. I gave you a word. You gave me a word back. <laughs> you told me. You told me. You said I'm gonna say one word and what comes to mind. Okay. You said disappointment. That okay. You right. You're I'm right. I'm disappointed damn. that you failed. I, I want to dig a little deeper. I'm like, damn. I want to dig deeper. Like, why would you be? Why would you be disappointed if you failed? Um. Because I worked hard to do what I'm trying to do. You know what I'm saying? Like, I worked hard. So when I fail, it's disappointment, but I get back up. Like, you know what I'm saying? Like, and I work harder and I figure it out. Ooh, you just talk to me. Talk to me. All right. <laughs> All right. I can't The next you. word. <laughs> the next word. Oh, I'm bad with these words. The next word is family. Fuck them. I'm gonna keep them 1,000 with you. I love some of them, but I don't fuck with them like that. You know what I'm saying? So that's all I'm gonna say on that topic. Okay, copy that. <laughs> you gave me them two words. I ain't gonna run with those. Okay, all right. The next word is friendship. Next word. <laughs> <laughs> all right. Next word. All right, the next word is love. What you asking me though? Like, what you want me to say about oh, love? God, the name of the game. Is the name <laughs> of the game. You can't say like, why, why you want me to move forward after I roll the dice? I love, <laughs> I love my son. You know, like that's what I think about when I think about love, my baby. So that's all I can say. I don't know. Okay, like, copy that. Copy that. Copy that. Copy I that. love music. Boom. Damn, you just took my next word. All right, my next word is studio sessions, all nighters. Gang in this bitch. <laughs> <laughs> oh, I like Jeez. Jeez. all of that. Fuck you, you see the love for music right now. Big thoints, big blunts. Okay. The next word. Peace. Home. Like I super <laughs> introvert in energy right there. <laughs> 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 okay, like right. shit. When I think about peace, I think about home, going home. Where I ain't got to deal with nobody. I'm in my own domain. Everybody, nobody asks me to do shit, want shit. Well, my baby, but he don't even really want shit. So, Jeez. cool. Jeez. Jeez, man. Yeah, man. So, uh, we finna get our last little picking up the brains from Miss DJ right after this break. Y'all stay tuned. Shut up. Shut up. Shut up and hustle. I tell them my sir, bitch, shut up and hustle. Yeah. Shut up and hustle. Shut up. Shut up and hustle. I tell them my sir, bitch, shut up and hustle. Yeah. You know? I'm a real nigga For those who don't know People be trying to figure me out I don't know if people be thinking Somebody tell me people think I'm gay And I was just like Really? Like is that the image I give off? 
tell them you happy as a bitch. Like, I'm not. Tell them you happy as a bitch. I'm not. Like, I'm just a real nigga at heart. Like, I don't be into that other shit. I really be chilling. Like, I don't be on that. So, maybe that's why it seemed like that. Jeez. What the fuck said you was gay? People was, somebody asked me that before, like, yeah, we booked it, we, we, we thought she was gay. Like, I don't know if it's because of, like, my demeanor or how I rap or, like, I don't know what the fuck was, but <clears throat> it just surprised me. I'm like, what? That shit crazy. Mm-hmm. Maybe because, you know, people try to figure your life out through social media. So when people don't see me with nobody or, like, they don't see me post nobody, they feel like I don't got nobody or maybe it's mm-hmm. something, or you know what I'm saying? Like... Mm-hmm. So, cause I'm a private person. Like I post what I want people to see. Like you could never figure me out through social media. Like, yes. so people be trying to, and I just feel like, I don't know what vibe I'm giving. So up. are you? Are, am I what? Yeah. No, I'm not gay, <laughs> y'all. I got to ask this the host. I'm not gay, y'all. I promise I'm not gay. This is not Lil Frank. I am ah, not gay. Shice, you should have said that. We were talking about the music, the Milwaukee music <laughs> shit. That's what I thought you was going to touch, y'all. Oh, shit. But Ooh. no, I fuck with Lil Frank. Hold on, wait. Because yeah, no one, one thing about it, you cannot deny a, a lyricist. You know what I'm saying? Yeah. Y'all can say that what y'all want to say about Lil Frank, but Lil Frank is a real musician. He could probably out rap half of you niggas. Like yeah, no Lil bullshit. Frank get that hey, y'all can say that he gay shit. I even, even if are, like, but even this, if Lil Frank is gay, let that man be gay. He can be gay if he wanna be gay. Fuck y'all. Like simple. Y'all y'all he can he can rap better than y'all, so what's the problem? Why are you talking about ankles? But Lil Frank, <laughs> Lil Frank, bro, like, <laughs> yeah, she's a bit dumb. but Lil Frank, like he came to one of my first ciphers and Lil Frank he was like, I, don't, I ain't going to put no age on him. But that's the a, thing, too. Lil Frank been doing this shit since he was he a youngin', for real. Kid. You and niggas don't, you niggas don't understand that. Yes, like. Bars. bars. And then after we spit the bars, this nigga was the youngest nigga in the party. And not the party, but in the cypher. And he continued his way to the other younger artists, yes. female artists, and start getting at them. Like, as he should as, as he women should. like like and y'all saying he gay like man y'all don't know love frank man like, but so right. what even yeah. if he is let him live his life yeah. like he so man. what fact. Fact. he can rap like you can't I deny talent nigga, i fuck with dog man like dog you better answer about deal back too because you know what the fuck is going on but like yeah that's crazy dog like this so um Hell i don't know yeah. where we left off at we, we coming off commercial break, man. In case y'all just tapping in, man. We rocking with DJ, man. The official last check, man. Miss Rocker Hoodie during a music rap video, man. Miss <laughs> <laughs> Go Crazy, man. So, uh, man, Rich Nerds, man. Like, let's let's touch on my boy, man. Cause like, man, how you how you how you bag that? Um, how you intertwine that? Cause like, dude, hard to get. He hard as a bitch to get in contact with, man. That's crazy. That's crazy. Cause I don't know. I don't know. Like, I, it was easy to get in touch with him. Yeah, it was I, easy. Just a little simple little DM. You know what I'm saying? Whoop whoop. Jeez, jeez. But um, shit. He work with people that got that potential too. So I ain't gonna count. But I'm not like a, a hounded motherfucker though either, because that make people like for the people who be thinking that people be hard to get in touch with and be hounding people and shit. Like people don't know it's entrepreneurs, and I'm just speaking for all the entrepreneurs. Like this shit is just like a job to us. Like when y'all go clock into y'all nine to five and you and you in that motherfucker to five o'clock, we in that motherfucker to five o'clock, and then once five o'clock is over, we're not doing <laughs> not that anymore. Man, like good, man, yeah, you know what I'm saying? So people don't understand that either. So, you know what I'm saying? I hit him up, he hit me back in a good little time we matter. And shit, we got that shit done. That shit look good too. Man. Cause I fuck with him, like I fuck with Ray. Tough. That's my nigga. He been he did my first video. He he do all my videos. Which was crazy. Go ahead and shout that out real quick. Hell yeah. Shout out my nigga Ray in their gang. Ray, y'all already know. Fuck oh shit. That video Hold you dropped. I almost burnt my hair, y'all. Do that. But um <laughs> I ain't got no fire extinguishers. <laughs> <laughs> Dog, you funny as fuck. That'll be viral. <laughs> no. Nah. But um yeah, shout out my nigga Ray. You already know what was going on, Ray. Uh, um, rich nerds, I fuck with rich nerds too. That's one of the uh, video I guess friends I worked with. Hopefully, I get to see some more. I don't know. I don't really got nobody on my radar like that from here right now. Right. But I fuck with y'all. Period. Yeah. Do y'all thing. Copy that. <laughs> Let me shoot a vid too, man. Hold on. Man. <laughs> I shoot vids too. 
You feel me? I do shoot big. Shit, I ain't know. I ain't know. My bad. I ain't know, nigga. <laughs> but like, yeah, man. So like, yeah, you know we had to pick the brains of Miss DJ. Period. You know what I'm saying? Man, I'm going to have to call this like a smoke session or uh You probably high as hell off of this. crackers or something like that. I'm fucking but, um, dead. Definitely had to pick the brains, man. Like, I'm I'm glad that you came. Come fuck with me. I'm glad you can uh, turn me down. Never. You, you Hollywood is a bitch right no now. No, the fuck I'm not. And I don't, I'm not a clout chaser. For all y'all motherfuckers out there, y'all be some clout chasers. And that shit is not okay. Like, Jeez. I'm not with that shit. I'm real authentic. You can't buy me, bitch, or none of that shit. So, for, and for everybody who out there who just <coughs> dick riding these niggas, I don't fuck with y'all. But, um, Thank you, best of the best, for having me on here, period. Yeah, facts, man. I appreciate that, man. Jeez. <laughs> I'm so blessed. Yeah, man. I'm just uh, saying it's the real shit. Facts, man. Facts. Man, we rocking out with your girl, DJ. And shout out to your fans, man. Give us a little message to your fans. Right. Man. I love y'all. Y'all already know. All my fans, all my clients, because they support me to the... Listen, they not going to play about me. None of them. Yeah, facts. They going 10 toes about me. And I see that. And that's facts. just on period. I love all of y'all. And stay tuned, because I got more to come. I got the EP dropping soon and the mini doc. So stay tuned for that. And I promise y'all, I'm going to get on my YouTube shit, too. Because I see that y'all be wanting to see what's going on. And I'm going to let y'all see what's going on. So... That period part, that part what she said man we be rocking out with your girl miss dj man it's your boy sir queen you already know man hey we just went um we just got syndicated we on iheart pandora we everywhere across the world man so i need everybody that's watching this to share it man it's just a simple share man. okay share this shit. just a simple share man i know i know y'all probably want to do this shit too man but it's just a simple share i can show you how to do it she can show you how to do it too okay. man but like it's just a simple share simple like a simple post or some shit like that man but yeah we just got syndicated we worldwide right now man so I can use y'all support, man. We've been yes. rocking. I've been, I've been supporting y'all, man. Support the kid back. You okay, feel what I'm and that's just on period. And whoever fuck with me, y'all better come support this channel. Because if y'all don't, don't think I'm going to fuck with you. Because I'm not going to fuck with you. No cap, bro. So, so you already know what time it is, man. It's your boy, Sir Quinn and DJ. I'm going to put you in the outro, man. And we already know. You already know what time it is, man. Period. I tell them like, sir, be shut up and hustle. Shut up. Shut up and hustle. Shut up. Shut up and hustle. Shut up and hustle. I tell them my sir, be shut up and hustle. Shut up and hustle. Shut up and hustle. Shut up and hustle. I tell them my sir, be shut up and hustle.